Hello everyone, it is time for me to record a whole bunch more Suikoden 4, uh, and because I am low on content on my channel, I figured I would walk you guys through the pretty complex setup I gotta do in order to capture this game. Uh, and I'm gonna upload it straight from my phone because today is when I gotta upload, and meanwhile I'm gonna be spending all day today recording videos. So, let's jump to it. Uh, we are playing on the PS3 right here and going up to the TV there. Now we're not going HDMI out from here, uh, although the game can be played like that. Although, actually, you know what? I'm going to mute the TV because I'm getting some distracting audio things going on here. But we've still got some audio. I'll tell you what that's from in a second. But we are PS3 uh, and we can't do HDMI out because the game has HDCP protection, meaning that I cannot record uh, through HDMI. So instead we're using that kind of AV out here that would normally plug into your uh, red, green, blue, uh, or just your yellow connector out to your TV. Uh, that is coming out and is plugging into the Avermedia uh, recorder, uh, Live Gamer Portable, right here. Now if you haven't seen my previous uh, studio tour, what I do with the Live Gamer Portable is that I record to an SD card. I record to an SD card on that and on my camera and then edit afterwards from that rather than trying to capture to any sort of computer. I'm trying to talk too fast and not breathing enough, which is going to make this video fun because I'm not editing it at all. Anyway, we are going into the Live Gamer Portable and then HDMI out goes back up to the TV. So that gets that set and that makes that able to record, but that is only one step of the puzzle. So let's trace this other cable back here. This is an audio cable. This has the audio out coming from there, comes through here where there's some coupling, we'll get to that in a second, but goes to the headphones that I wear while recording. Which are pretty loud. So if I talk loud while I'm doing Suikoden so in recording, it's because of that. So headphones, um, then from those headphones, uh, that has both uh, audio in and out. So coming back here to where we've got these couplings, then the microphone comes out and goes up to the camera. At least if I remember to plug it in, which I'm pretty sure I did here. I'll do my full test and make sure that everything is properly going at that point. Anyway, we go to the camera, which I haven't fully set up yet, but again, will once I sit down. Um, that has the audio in right there. So it records my audio while I'm talking to the camera. The only other bit here is that we've got the PS3 controller that stays plugged in through USB to the PlayStation the entire time. And that's kind of everything. It sounds pretty simple when I walk you through like that, but it took me a bit to figure out and to get the logistics going, but everything should be ready to go. So I'm ready to start recording episode 41 of Suikoden 4. Thank you guys for watching this. And I will see you next week with some actual so we could episodes. I tried to catch the logo in the lower right corner. Didn't quite do it. Oh, the other thing that I'll say is that since recording last time, I got a new bed. Um, which does two things. Number one, it is lower. So uh, wherever I'm sitting is actually a little lower compared to the room. And uh, I can't quite prop up the sword and the game box like I used to on the previous one. The other thing it does is that this is a king-size bed. So whereas with the TV right here, I used to be kind of more or less across from it right here. Now I'm going to be over here. I considered going on that side, but just the wouldn't be quite the right angle with my face and the face cam where, where I have it up in the corner. So anyway, guys, thank you for watching. And I will see you next week with actual Suikoden episodes, which I have to start recording right now. Bye, everyone.